Good morning and welcome to Australia. I really have to stop going to sleep with my chainsaw in my hands. It is Thursday, the 19th day of summer, and we are going to map out a little bit of our town today. I'm going to grab the compactor and the dirt printer. I'm going to check out my crop area and none of this beetroot is ready yet. None of the rice is ready yet. Oh, we have quite a few empty spots here. So, are you ready? No. So, 48, let's say 58, we'll say 60. Plus a few more, but let's see, it's the 19th. Yeah, we can get a few crops in probably towards the end of the year. Uh, season, rather. Um... Yeah, we got a couple watermelons that are ready. Okay, that all looks pretty good. I will say hello to our animals. And then we also have some uh, moo capturing to do today. Okay, I've said hello to the animals and this looks like a treasure spot, so we'll take that up. And I believe I put some meat in the crab pots last night. Yep. See what we've got here. Oh, okay. We got a little bit of a a permit points bonus for walking. Not that we walk that much. Okay, I'm just gonna put some of this food away. And the treasure stuff. And I think I'm going to uh, not collect anything from my animals today. I really want to get going. Oh, we have a visitor. So, Sheila. Do we dare offer to do a favor for her? She wants bread. Yeah, we can do that. And what is she paying top dollar for? jelly brew. I don't think I have any of that. And even if I did, I think it's one of those things that I would probably keep for myself. Okay. Flour. I forget how many flour it takes to make bread, so I'll just grab half of it. Three. Okay. Okay. And I feel like there's a few things here that I still want to get rid of. The yabbies, the pasty or pasty, uh, the fairy bread I was going to explore and see what that gave me. I think we said it gave me some uh, speed. Okay, I don't know why I have 76 bush lime on me. Let's take a minute to see what we have to do today. Spend 3,000 dink. That'll give us 300 permit points. Wow. Smelt some ore into a bar. Okay, well, I'll get that started right away. And I also want to see if I have what I need. One, two, three, four, five. To um, order a new mining thing from Franklin. And I don't. I didn't get any. Uh, keys. Okay. So there's the ore in there, and... I want to put some of this stuff back. And I don't think I need these lamps on me. Oh, storage is full. OK. 
Okay, I might put those down in town anyway. Um, I also need my crab soup. We'll just take two for now. Okay, we'll hand this to Sheila. And then we're going to go see John. And spend 3,000 ink. And we got a beach straw hat. I also noticed that I need to smelt two bars, which won't be a problem, but just wish I had noticed earlier. Okay, gonna sell all this stuff to John. Let's see what this gets us. Ooh. <laughs> 430,230 dink. Amazing. Okay. So we're going to buy a mine pass. And that's 300 permit points. And do we have anything else that I want to buy? House customization kit. Hmm, how much is that? Okay, I think I'll skip it for today. Okay. Now to visit Franklin, see what he's got. Palmwood table. Nah. I am going to buy a repair kit though. And did I want to go see Fletch? We have a lot of money and the debt town is in a lot of debt. I wonder if I should just donate. There we go. Okay. Now Gonna bring these guys down here. I'm gonna eat some crab soup and a couple of eggs. And I'm gonna get to work. As I said in the last episode, I wanna make this like a wide boulevard. going. Now that might be a wide enough boulevard there. And let me see about what kind of flooring I could put down there. It probably should be like a regular street. Um, I feel like we have a lot of brick. Let me go and see what kind of pathing we can make. I 
I kind of like the gravel pathways. Um, while I'm thinking about it, let me just grab more. Or to smelt. And I do want to run over to the mining chest and put some stuff in there. Okay, back to here. And let's see. Oop, did not mean to run in there. Although, I should run in there. <laughs> let's see. Beetroot, seven days. Rice, green beans. I guess I'll grab 60 beetroot. Okay. And we'll take care of that later. Oops. And I do want to bring all this down. I don't know where my jackhammer is. It might have fallen behind the charger. sure about this over here. Yeah, maybe I'll take all this down too. I wonder if I should make all of this the same level. Yeah, why not? I feel like it kind of takes away interest, but I don't know. I think I want it all to be the same level. I'll probably have to... do... <laughs> keep running into her store. Do something with... Rain Shop, because that can't be left like that. Okay. Now I'm going to run back and look for my jackhammer as well as put this on the charger. And there it is. It was behind the machine. And I completely forgot that this uh, advanced blast furnace does two. And my lime is ready, lime jam, and we'll make some more. So 
I kind of have a lot going on now all of a sudden. Um, hmm. Okay, I think I know what I want to do now. I think I'm going to go with the gravel pathway and see how I like that. Okay, let's see. I think I might separate this a little bit with like, I don't know, some flowers or something. Um, so I think I'm gonna do the gravel here. here I'm not sure if I want it to be butted right up against John's store I don't think so I'm just gonna jackhammer these things out of the way Guess these two. In the beginning, I kind of had this idea that I wanted things to be like very, um, what's the word, like rudimentary. But maybe not so much anymore. I might still keep these, but I kind of don't like the way I have them all laid out. And I have never liked these. So we're going to get rid of those too. Okay, let's finish putting this gravel down. I think I might go a bit wider. a little by the visitor's tent. And then as we get to, like, I kind of think of this as my property. Um, I should have taken this down, too. Do I have two compactors or two printers? Ooh, I have two compactors. Uh, let me grab these slate real quick and put them in the key maker. We got a little, little bit of rain coming our way. Uh, there. <laughs> Forgot momentarily where I wanted to put those. Okay, bring this down. Okay. 
And I think I'll... Oh, we need more, but I think I'll curve this over like that. Um, so, will Jimmy be around now? Doesn't look like it. Okay, it's almost 7 o'clock, so... Let me run around and see if I can find a moo. Um, I wonder if cooked meat or a drumstick would get them interested. I really don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid, uh, you know, hurting them. So I'm going to go up here. Oh, I don't think I have any capture spots up here. So instead, I'm going to go down here and see if there's any. Here's some copper. So I think that X on the map is for a, a collection point. Yeah. Now, if I happen to see any moo around here... I don't see any. Got a ton of wattle plants over here, though. I see lots of kangaroos. No moves. Okay, I think I might abandon that quest. Just because, you know, it's not for anybody, it's just for money, I guess. And instead, maybe I'll look for some treasure spots. Ooh, which reminds me, I should probably go check out the, uh, the mine that I ordered, or the quarry, that I ordered from Franklin. It might have something already. Not a button board that we need, it's an old toy. I see a pearl. Oh my gosh. Do I have my fishing pole on me? I don't. 
Oh man. That was a giant, what was it, marlin? Or tuna? Let's see. I'm wondering if it's worth, hmm. It's worth running back. Also, that pearl wasn't marked. Let me see if I can find exactly where it was. Well, there's that fish again. Um, I think I might run back and get my fishing pole and try to get that. Oops, wrong way. That's the comp fishing bowl. That'll work though, right? Uh, I think my regular one is over by the, the mining chest. I think I might have thrown it in there. Yeah, there it is. I can't believe I'm going to all this trouble just to catch one fish. And you know what? I should have grabbed a fish and chips while I was back at the house. Ah, uh, well. Is he still here? There's a couple of big ones there, actually. fish. Yeah, I don't see him. Oh, that's a shame. I don't see him anymore. Oops. <laughs> okay. Let me see if I just throw this out here. And maybe he's around. I really wasn't ready for this guy to latch on. Thirty now.
Okay, well at least I got a couple of bluefish. They're worth a nice amount of money, I think, so I can probably take those home and cook them up and make some money. Oh, and we're officially late. And I got a little bit hurt there swimming. Okay, let me unmark this. And mark the tele tower to get back to it. I'm just going to take a couple of seconds and look for treasure spots around this tower. Got full pockets. All right, let's see here. I'll throw some stuff in here. Yep, still only have one toy. Okay. And we'll crush this shiny stone. up a couple of fish. I have a lot of stuff to put away. throw down these beetroot seeds that we got. Okay. What else did I want to do before I head to bed? Oh, I wanted to put away a lot of these things. Okay, so as much as I don't want to have an extra storage box laying around, I am going to take a bunch of this stuff out of here.
and put them in a different storage box. So I really want the green one to be for all the plants and stuff. Okay, I think I've got everything put away the way I want it. I don't know where to put these termite nests. Okay, I've already got some over here. Good. Okay, the yellow wattle flower I'm going to sell to John along with all those Billy Button. These are mining things. The saltwater fish I'm going to sell. I do need another storage box for my tools, because uh, I'm also, I also have too many tools.
Okay, so this one is for weapons. This one is for tools. And all my gardening tools I put over here in this one. And this is building materials. And this is plants and seeds. All right, I think I'm all set. You get this jackhammer down here. And I'm still figuring out what to do here. This, I'm probably going to move this. What do I use all the time? I use the store, Franklin, and Rain Shop. So I want to turn her so that she'll be facing me or facing the street. And then maybe I'll turn John so that he's... No, I kind of want him to be on the, the town square. Um, what is this? Thread space. I hardly ever use that, so maybe I'll put that over in town somewhere. And I'm going to put the tucker box somewhere around here, so I also have to move uh, Irwin. We'll figure that all out. <laughs> okay, maybe we'll figure that out tomorrow. Poor Sheila. Like, I'm running around with her deed in my hand and I haven't done anything with it. Okay, thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you join me again. Until then, stay safe and take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>